welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be making some matte eyeshadows. This shade is shade Waves. This is from my website and this is just a pretty blue matte shade. Make sure you start by cleaning your area, cleaning your utensils, washing your hands, and using gloves if you need to. I am using a mortar and pastel metal mixer thing and this is what I mix my matte eyeshadows with. It's easy to clean. I'm using my measuring spoons, a stirring stick, some eyeshadow pans, an eyeshadow press or um, a pressing tile I mean. I'm starting out by adding to the mix my mix press base. This is the mixture that kind of presses the shades together or the ingredients. I am adding just one tad. Now I'm adding TKB matte texture base. This gives it a matte texture and I add just a little bit of this. I'm adding a dash of the matte texture base. Now the pigment, I'm adding TKB Matte Blue Pop. This is a pretty blue color. And I wanna add more of the pigment than the white bases to get the pigmentation I want. Now I'm just going to stir it up to get the white and blue kind of mixed together. Now I'm just grinding it all together until I don't see any white specks anymore. I'm going to add the wet ingredients, a little bit of alcohol. I don't use a lot, but I use 91% alcohol. I am just only adding a pinch of the alcohol. I don't want to add a lot. Next, I'm adding a little bit of pressing medium. I don't want my ingredients to be too wet. I'm looking for the crumbly kind of texture like wet sand. I'm only adding two to three drops of the medium. And as you can tell, it kind of got a little messy with this. But I'm just grinding all this mixture together until I can tell Everything is evenly mixed. So this is what I like it to look like when it's all mixed together. It kind of presses down on the bottom, but it's still kind of crumbly and yeah, it's such a pretty color. This is what I use to press my matte eyeshadows. It comes in handy 
it was a little expensive I got it from TKB trading but it's worth it and then I use a pressing ribbon that I got from TKB trading as well now I'm packing the pan with the pigment now I'm just patting it down with my stirring stick and I'm gonna have to do a couple layers of this but because when you press it down it kind of pushes everything to the bottom So after trying so many different ways of making matte eyeshadow, this is the way that I found that I like the most. I've watched a lot of YouTube videos and researched a lot about making matte eyeshadows and it's very, very hard. It's not as easy as it looks, but I finally found something that I like and just works for me. I just wanted to share the way I make them. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video about making matte eyeshadows. Um, if you have any suggestions, any comments, concerns, comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, all that fun stuff. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Hey, so let's test out my matte uh, blue shade waves. I'm going to use a fluffy brush for this and I also have my eyes already primed with some concealer so let's just pack this matte shade on. So there's the first layer of the shade. Thank you. Love you. There's the second layer. Maybe a little blotchy right here but we're going to blend it out and see how it does. Okay now I grab more of a loose kind of fluffy brush and I'm going to pick up some more pigment and I'm just going to blend away on that brush. You know what I mean? I'm gonna pull it out a little bit. 